everybody, what's up? It's Kiki and welcome back for another video. to my channel make sure you hit that subscribe button become part of the kick squad while you're at it hit that notification bell so that you are notified when i post a new video today i'm coming to you guys to talk about my blue bob everybody was loving this blob blob everybody was loving this blue bob while i was in la and yes i definitely had to come tell you guys all about this hair i've had it installed for probably like a week and a half already so I didn't get to do an initial video when I first put it in because like I said, I was in LA, honey. This wig is from OMG Her Hair. I have reviewed for them many times before. So I love their hair. Definitely a fan of their hair. Actually recommend their hair to my family. My cousin just purchased a wig from them. The last wig that I reviewed, she purchased that from them and she loves it. So definitely a fan of OMG Her Hair. This time I got the Gabrielle Union Bob. It did come in a natural color, but I let my stylist who, you know, I done got real lazy with my hair, so I will let somebody else do it for me. I let my stylist color it and install it. Um, it is glued with, got to be glued, no, lies. It is glued with ghost bond, and I just touched it up so you guys will see how I fixed my lifting frontal wig as well as how I style it. In the box, you do get a little instruction manual. You get a comb wig caps with the perfect color brown cap and eh, hit myself and an elastic band i didn't need any of those because my stylist actually applied it i wanted to mention that omg her hair is having a black friday sale going on from the 17th to the 28th so make sure you guys go check them out or have all the information in the description box so if you guys want to see how i take this bob from this to this keep watching so like I said this week is from OMG her hair and I have just had it tied down for the last three days um, I have had it installed for a week and a half and my glue has just started to lift up but I'm not gonna go ahead and add more glue I'm just going to add some guys to be so that it's secure for the next couple days that I wear this wig this wig originally came in a natural black but I let my stylist color it and I gave her the color to use. She used indigo blue. And I wanted to still stay in the blue family because I was really, really loving the blue. But this isn't the same color as the straight hair blue I had. Actually, this is a whiff from that, from that um, install. And as you can see, it's two different colors. This was done with the Royal Navy. And this was done with the indigo blue by Adora. So Royal Navy is 178 and indigo blue is 112. And that's this color. So I don't have any video of me actually coloring the hair because I didn't color it and when my stylist installed my hair um you guys might notice that my part is on the opposite side of what I normally wear it I don't know what what made me tell her to put it this way but I just did so yeah and like I said she glued it down using ghost bond so a week and a half and I'm just starting to lift so I'm gonna go ahead and fix this up style it fix my little edges up and show you guys what I do I did get 12 inches she did trim it just a little bit it had like a little bit more curl to it before it got bleached and dyed, but it still has like a wavy, curly look to it once it gets product in it and once it gets wet. This um, wig does have like a lot of middle parting, but not a lot of side parting because I would have wanted my parting, my part deeper to the side, but there's not a lot of lace. Like the lace is only probably like two inches back and then the middle, I think it's like four inches back. Yeah, something like that, so... I'm going to use the Gots to Be in the black container to tack this down and style the baby hairs at the same time. So I'm just going to squeeze a little bit on my hand. So just going to put it on the edge. Should have did this before I did my makeup though. I use a spoolie to smooth out the baby hairs. So this has really, really helped me. I forgot to mention I did bleach my knots. So this whole side lifted up so I gotta put it underneath. I 
and I'm going to tie it down. So while it's sitting, go ahead and start styling. Um, I have a little spray bottle here with water and the Afro G Curlific Curl Definer. I have a little bit of this in here and like 15%, 85% water. And then I use a little bit of Lotta Body Foam Wrap Lotion. All right, first I'm gonna spray it down with some water. Get it really damp. A little dry. Bit of this. Some foam lotion so it can hold. Now take a little bit of the wrap foam and just smooth the top down. So it's been about 10 15 minutes. It's still wet, but everything is down. Mmm, mmm. Look at that. Laid, honey, honey, lay down. So, got a little bit of gel on my forehead. So, use a q tip to get that off. As it dries, it does get a little bit fuller, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I have no problems with this wig. I love OMG her hair. I have reviewed their hair many of times. I will link them above, but yeah, definitely a fan of OMG her hair. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Hope you guys found it helpful. And yeah, you don't always have to, you know, re-glue it down. I think I did pretty darn good. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. Comment, share all the good stuff. I love you guys and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. Cause I want you and I need you and I'm down for you always